breaking news targeting ISIS terrorists. The U.S. and allies launch an aerial operation. NBC's Brian Moore joining us live now from the nation's capital. Thanks. The Pentagon confirms this was a coordinated attack. Fighter jets, bombers, missiles, all of them hitting just before dawn and about 20 targets in and around Raqqa, Syria, which is the self-declared capital of ISIS. Those targeted included headquarters, fuel and weapons depots, training sites. The United States did not carry out these attacks alone, according to Pentagon officials. The United States was accompanied by partner nations and significantly Arab countries were assisting in these attacks in some way, shape or form. Congress, of course, last week gave the go ahead for the Obama administration to go ahead and give uh, some training and arms to Syrian rebels, but that will take some time. This is just the beginning of what will be a long drawn out war with ISIS. And this opening salvo comes as President Obama gets ready to head tomorrow to the New York and the United Nations to try to enlist other nations in a coalition based attack. Uh, while this is nowhere near expected to be a death blow for ISIS, it is a significant expansion of a war against a very determined enemy that has shown its willingness to attack the United States. I'm Brian Moore in Washington. Now back to you. Thank you, Brian. Tune into 2 News today at 5 a.m. for more on this developing story.